Okay, I'm continuing right away. You know, basically we have two large groups of Roma people here in Slovenia in the south. So that is Dulinska region, which are basically, you know, considered as a, a social element. The majority isn't employed, they don't send their kids to elementary school even though it's mandatory they cannot enforce that um, things had changed had been changing for a better in the last couple of decades but very slowly you know um, majority of them are basically living in illegally built houses on property that doesn't belong to them you know on the property of, of municipalities or just you know some random guy they just set up their um, you know tents and then build their houses on and there were a lot of cases of you know they illegally acquiring uh, electricity directly from the um, power lines and so forth. Uh, as I said, quite a lot of them are involved in criminal activity of different varieties and serious um, level of serious um, level of se no le oh it's raining quite a lot level of serious no serious level of okay I cannot find the correct word Lise Griva Tuki Griva let's go towards home I don't want to get wet Fridna on the other hand the second large group that is in the northeast part of Slovenia in Prekmuria people cannot cannot basically find a bad word regarding them you know they own their own land they built very nice houses majority of vast majority of them are self-employed or employed quite a lot of them are also working in Austria which is very close you know to Prekmuria they send their kids to school uh, they value you know education um, they are basically completely integrated into a majority society in the society um, for example they you know they have there they have built their um, kindergarten I, they, I think you know they also have they built like elementary school or a division of elementary school i know for a fact that they also have their own um, volunteer firefighting society you know no you know i have uh, let's say we have relatives living both in Dulenska in Prikmuri region and you know in Dulenska several of them were all were victims of Roma people you know burglaries and thefts and so forth fortunately nothing physical but in Prikmuri you know people say that you can trust Roma the Prekmuria Roma more than Slovenes because they will do what you you know agree with them they will do it better than Slovenes and faster so yeah Nadela po povohi in gremo boji se te boji se te tale malveče od tebe Ja, eko sam povoha te rada. 
No, dej, no. A ti narep stupila, reč pa jo. To ma je, če več pa skupaj. Jo. No, dej, lizina morš, no, glej. Glej, koliko se te boji. Če ni nič, te dej. No, dej, lizeko. A zdaj pa ti ne moraš pustiti, da ti rad povoha, reč itak. Ok, gremo. So, je. No. Two completely different experiences with basically the same ethnic group um, living in two um, geographically distant, well distant, separated communities. Plus then we have also a third a group which are not technically Roma people but are seen this, I think it's called in English. Those, those, are, those are even more completely integrated into the uh, society, in general society. They mainly live, let's say, north, in the north-western part of Slovenia. Okay, we will stop on this point because it's raining too much.